This is Istvan, and I am here bringing you a let's play of Mass Effect. And uh, as you can see, that is definitely not the preset uh, female shepherd. I had kind of a very specific looking uh, person in mind. So instead of um, kind of making you sit through me clicking and moving the little spacers all over the place trying to figure out how to get her to look how I want her to look, I decided to go ahead and do that first and then we just run through this real quick and get on in with the game. So yeah, she, this uh, particular shepherd is going to be a spacer. Confirm psychological she is going to be the sole survival, sole survivor. Confirm military specialization. I'm going to be playing as an infiltrator. I actually really like this particular class quite a bit. I've always enjoyed sniper rifles and uh, the ability to use the little cool looking omni tool right there is nice as well. Usually I find myself gravitating towards the soldier almost with every character I've played so I try to branch out and the infiltrator is uh, usually my second choice. Uh, it doesn't really matter on this, I'm probably not going to use them but we'll take shotguns. And this is, uh, her name is Quinn. This is Quinn Shepard. Okay. Profile reconstruction complete. All right. Yes, thank Identification you. confirmed. Oh, I don't want it on insanity, not for a. Oh, I can't anyway. <clears throat> not for a first level character. Uh, yeah, we'll do veteran. So yeah, this is uh, Mass Effect. This is. Probably one of the best games, best uh, science fiction RPG-like games out there. I do actually prefer Mass Effect to the second one. Well, what about Shepard? <laughs> I hate Udina. He is such an ass. I'm kind of hoping that when uh, Mass Effect 3 comes out, you get the option to kill Udina. Or you get some kind of option to sacrifice him or something for the good of mankind, which would definitely be doing mankind a favor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind Could be his voice, too. His voice is very annoying. I'll make the call. I bet if Udina knew the kind of shit he would be getting from Shepard, he probably wouldn't have made that call. Now that I'm sitting here listening to this, I don't, I can't remember if I turn the music off or not. Oh well. Hopefully it's not going to be too intense. If it is, I might turn it down in later parts, but we'll just... We'll leave it how it is in this first part. Arcturus Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Probably the uh, best secondary character in the game right there, Joker. <laughs> we are connected. Oh, I can't skip this part. Calculating transit mass and destination. Yeah, this is one of my favorite Bioware games. And uh, as Dragon Age 2 proved, they are definitely better at making science fiction games than they are making fantasy games. Though the first Dragon Age was awesome. do something. They don't let you skip the Thrusters, first sequence. Check. Navigation. Check. Internal emission sync engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. <laughs> I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. 
So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. <laughs> I don't like having them on board. Yeah, just remember that I'm you paranoid. said that, Joker. You're paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. I haven't really decided how I'm going to play her just yet. We're you always expect the worst. Now, well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so what are we doing here? Joker, status report. <laughs> just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find oh, cool. I can skip and link us into the network. And I apologize if you aye, actually aye, want to listen to the Better brace yourself, sir. dialogue of this. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the... You get that, Commander? Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm going to pay for it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's always in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Yeah, gee, I wonder why. Somebody having a smart-ass for a pilot isn't going to make you upset or in a bad mood or anything. I grew up on Eden Prime, Doc. It's not the kind of place Spectres visit. There's something Nihilus isn't... Well, apparently... It is the kind of place that Spectres visit. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. He's going to try to hit on her. What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. <laughs> Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. No, nope, he's actually interested in you, Shepard. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a proof okay, once that again, humanity can I not only establish just, colonies <laughs> across the galaxy, yeah. but also protect them. I've played this game so But how so safe much. is it, really? Why are you asking? Do you know something? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Oh, no. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. <laughs> Duh. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. <laughs> Should I be an ass to Captain Anderson? Nah. There we'll must be, be nice a reason you didn't tell now. me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need to know basis. Well, I'm going on the mission, so For I think I need to know. Eden Prime. Unearth some kind of beacon during an excavation. What else can you tell me? <laughs> this is big, Shepard. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. I'm going to skip through it anyway. So. Obviously, yeah. this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. <laughs> he's a Turian. There's more, Yes. Shepard. And he's surrounded by Nihilus humans, so yes, he's expecting people. trouble. He's also here to evaluate you. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. The Alliance has been pushing for this for I must have done something time. weird with her mouth, because this Humanity not, wants a larger role. Her mouth in isn't moving right when she's talking. We want more say with the Citadel Council. I must have messed it up. The Spectres when I was represent tweaking. the Council's power and authority. Not and many whatever. could have That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this shepherd. <laughs> We're uh, counting on you. I need to see your She has a myself, stiff lower lip, her. apparently. Eden Prime You'll will be, be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to it. Mm. Captain, we got a problem. She made it all the way to command even Joker? with a slight speech impediment due to her non-moving bottom lip. Bring it up on screen. <clears throat> she must not have any nerves or anything in it. Childhood accident. Get down! Oh, Man, there's the most annoying main character in the game.
I like how he says that. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Like he knew exactly where it was. Status report. I didn't see any numbers on the screen, so he just like out, Captain, no picked a random number out of his ass, and it happened to be the right one. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission <laughs> That's just what she got said. a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. <laughs> Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo looks confused. <laughs> I should have made her a blonde. Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. All right. Pick up a main character and cannon fodder.